Hi everybody, this is Don Campbell with expand to web and WordPress 3.3 is out and I wanted to take you on a quick tour and just kind of show you around the interface and what it looks like if you haven't upgraded yet. So the first thing you notice when you upgrade, uh, the process is very smooth um, and when you come in to your site for the first time, you get this new welcome message and this is intended to just kind of bring you in and show you some of the steps, some of the basic settings and how to add content and customize your site. Looks like they're trying to kind of guide you through the experience. It's a nice little, uh, you know, welcome message. You can dismiss it when you're done, uh, but it's kind of cool. Uh, the other thing that you'll notice is when you're in the admin section, instead of clicking on each of these admin bar areas, you just hover over them and they give you all of the options underneath. So it's really quick and easy to find what you're looking for that way. You can still collapse the menu as well and have the hovers hover over things kind of come out like that. It's kind of cool. So that's kind of nice, more compact, um, easier to navigate. The other thing you'll see is the admin bar. Uh, they've refactored that and changed some things, made it more simple. Uh, you can still navigate to your admin area, your comments, or create new posts or pages or users or things like that. So they've really kind of simplified uh, the admin bar as well. Now the other thing that I'm really excited about here is the media uploading. So if I go to my blog posts here, let's edit the default post that comes with WordPress. It's kind of nice because now what they've done is if you notice this bar along the top, they've changed it so that instead of having to decide what kind of media you're uploading, you just there's just one media upload button and they do the smarts of detecting, hey, did you upload a video or a photo or an MP3 file? And WordPress has really simplified that. It also has a drag and drop area, so you can still select files like you did before, or if you want, you can just go in and drag and drop some files. So I'm gonna grab a few files here, a few photos, and just drag them in. And what you're gonna see is WordPress is just uploading them automatically for me. So instead of having to go select them, I just kind of drag and drop and, and put them in there. So it's kind of nice, right? So I can easily save all my photos and show particular ones and insert them right into the post if I want to. So they've really simplified that whole experience as well. The Well, one thing I wanted to show you in here too that isn't new to WordPress 3.3, but a lot of people get confused on, is when I'm looking at this post, what if I wanted to turn off comments for this blog post, for example? I don't see it down here. It's moved away. And if you look up near the top, the screen options, this is an area where um, they, what they do is they hide a lot of things that you're not using and then you can just check them to turn them back on again. And so what's interesting is uh, if, you're, if you're not seeing what you're looking for, make sure to go up to this bar along the top and check the items to add them back into your interface. They're just trying to streamline the interface for you. So that was another thing I just wanted to show you because I get asked about it a lot. Okay, so let's update this post. I wanna show you another area under settings. And if I go down to permalinks, They've improved the permalinks, and these are the URLs that show up for your pages and your posts. And they've included my favorite one here, just the post name. I always like to change it to just post name, and in the past you had to enter that as, an, as a custom structure. Now that's one of the high level structures here that they offer. And they've also improved, there were some performance issues with that type of permalink if you had really, really large sites with lots of pages and they've, they've improved that as well. So lots of new things here in the new WordPress. Um, you're gonna see that the main site itself looks very much the same, um, but the administration area is all different. Uh, well, not all different, but they've really streamlined some things and made it pretty cool. Uh, final note is we've been testing this with uh, the small biz theme since the early betas and everything's fine, works great. Uh, so check it out and I uh, hope you uh, upgrade. You shouldn't have any problems upgrading. If you, if you do, let us know, okay? Thanks a lot.